Okay, what I have here now again, I've got my DC power supply, it's variable. Uh, I've got the iron wire hooked up to the pulse width modulator at a high frequency because I think there's only 16 winds. Then I have a multi wind of a number 24 gauge. Then I have a 12 gauge house wire being pulsed. And the pulse is coming off to the 12 volt rear tear light lamp of a car. And you'll see. I can adjust it. You see the amperage going up to about one amp. At and that's about 10 to 15 volts here. As I turn it, you know. <clears throat> but there's also a high frequency one here, and I get zapped by it. I get zapped if I touch it and it's a uh, high frequency voltage in the RF range oops I don't want to get hit by it oops because my camera will go flying too You see when I put it on there, the lamp dims a little bit. Matter of fact, it takes it right out. And if I disconnect the lamp, I think that high voltage comes back. Yep, you can see the sparks there. Not real powerful, but not bad. So that's what I have. Something's cooking, so I'm going to turn it off. Yep, my fit is cooking. Turn it off. But anyway, this is a uh, iron wound, copper wound, and um, bifiler wound number 24 gauge. This one has multi winds, single wind, and bifiler wind, and iron wind on the back end of it. So I'm thinking of pulsing a uh, connected side and see what kind of results I get then. So That's it for In the Cabin, uh, October 8th, 2015, at um, 60 degrees outside. Looks like we had some rain and drizzle today. And uh, we get some people to chop down our dead trees out there. Some nice people, Doug and Scott, our neighbors. I hope they can be able to hear some future stuff. These are iron wound with copper. There's one side of one. The green wire is the iron. It's magnetic wire, but it's not magnet wire. The magnet wire is the one that's orangish, reddish. And these are my other wines. I got a whole bucket full of them here. Those are mostly high voltage. These are on another video. Tell me the turns and the some of them the homage and the turns. So anyway, that's what I have here today, and I want to close it on uh, the light bulb being lit, and that will be it for today.